Hey everybody, have another Hot Wheels review. This is the USS Vengeance from 2019. It's number 52 out of 250 in the series. It is number 7 out of 10 from the Screen Time series. And as you can see, I already opened it because I previously tried to do a review of it and it didn't turn out well, so I have to redo it, but I already had it open. The back really doesn't tell us anything. Now, this had previously been released in 20. 14 because in 2013 it appeared in the movie star trek into the darkness and so that's what this is from it is from that that film and this is a pretty nice sized hot wheel it's pretty big it, it feels a little bit bigger than most especially especially the way it's uh spread out uh it is you know the the saucer part is die cast this these parts right here these are uh more of a durable plastic you can see it bends a little bit but i don't want to bend it too much because i'll leave it crooked and it comes with its own stand which is really cool and one thing i like is not only do you have the star trek logo there on the side but also if you tilt it like this it kind of looks like the logo as well that is pretty cool and it sits on the stand pretty well i've had a few times that it tilted over but overall i like it i really like when you have these uh ships that come with their own stands just like right here the Milanio from Guardians of the Galaxy. I think that's a really cool thing, especially when it only costs a dollar. So this has a pretty uh, cool look. I really like the painted details on the saucer section itself. The rest of it, it's okay. But overall, it looks pretty cool. You have the little V there. You could say V for vengeance. It also looks like it's like an old school pop bottle opener or soda pop uh, bottle opener. I don't know. What do you say? Do you say soda or pop? I guess it depends where you're from. But overall, I think this is a nice looking Hot Wheels, especially for only a dollar. Now, if you don't want to go hunt it down in stores right now, you just want to buy it off eBay, you're going to pay a little more. After shipping, you're probably looking at five, six bucks, maybe a little bit more for the 2014 uh, version that came out before. I do not know that there's much of a difference between those two versions from what little pictures I saw. They look pretty much the same. And of course, in this one, there is no wheels. So if I just set it down here, it just will go it'll lean to the side, uh, which, you know, that's why they include the, the stand, which is a nice feature. So there it is. It is the USS Vengeance from Star Trek. It is from 2019. And it is really cool, especially if you find it for a dollar. But that's just my thoughts. Go ahead, tell me what you think in the comments below. Be sure to click like and subscribe, and I will see you next time on the next Nose for a Gamer video.